be with uh, uh, my wonderful colleague, uh, Chairman uh, Berman, and in uh, supporting in a bipartisan way our, our good friend, uh, Bob King. And as, uh, as Howard said, all of us uh, remember our colleague and dear friend, the late Congressman Tom Lantos, Chairman of the House Foreign Affairs Committee, a lion on behalf of human rights around the world, and the co-founder of the Congressional Human Rights Caucus, the primary Democrat co-sponsor of the original North Korean Human Rights Act. And uh, we all know well that uh, none of us by ourselves can accomplish uh, uh, what needs to be done on Capitol Hill, and that uh, we depend on uh, trusted staff. And for a quarter of a century, um, Tom's key advisor and chief of staff was this extraordinary, capable, and principled, and level-headed expert named Dr. Robert King, with whom I'm honored to uh, appear today. In the 20 years that uh, my staff and I have worked with Bob, he has been instrumental in uh, promoting the uh, Congressional Human Rights Agenda, and uh, he's done so with great intelligence, commitment, and civility. And as Howard uh, discussed, his uh, resume, White House Fellow, uh, work, his work in Radio Free Europe, uh, uh, writer of many uh, scholastic uh, articles, uh, etc. And when I introduced the uh, North Korean uh, Human Rights Reauthorization Act in April of last year, Bob was in fact uh, still serving as staff director to the House Foreign Affairs Committee, and Congress did not have this particular person in mind when we strengthened the, uh, the, po the position of the special envoy and, uh, but when the law was enacted, uh, we certainly saw that, that Bob fits the bill perfectly. On one level, I hesitate to uh, push a trusted friend and colleague into the role of Special Envoy for Human Rights in North Korea, because I know what a hard job that will be, given the brutal nature of the regime and addressing the issues of uh, a vulnerable population and, uh, and hunted uh, refugees, but Bob King has never shrunk from uh, the hard work of doing the right thing at the right time. I have no doubt that uh, Dr. King will excel as special envoy, and I recommend him without hesitation. I thank the committee uh, senators for this opportunity to speak uh, before you today. Thank you. Thank you very much.